Well, this is Cool Dude Clem giving you a little update regarding the flyback situation. I've been hunting around for old junk TVs, and this is one of the flybacks out of one of the TVs I found. It's just out of a simple little portable TV. Haven't got the flyback out of the other one yet. Also, I'm not going to do a video about taking a flyback apart because, well, I tried to take one apart and unfortunately peeled off the plastic and underneath this is just more of that resin stuff so it's pretty much impossible to take one of these apart this is where the focus and screen knobs were you can see it's just a variable resistor nothing really special about that and this is part of the knob that I took off as you can see so that's about all I can sh that's about all I can show you inside one of them anyway going back to this thing this particular flyback may not be perfect because I do believe it's one of those ones that has the capacitor in it but go and turn power on I have the high voltage wire connected up to my screwdriver This is probably interfering with the microphone. Again, arcing across the pins, which isn't good. And you can see by those type of sparks, if you can hear me over it, of course, that this is one of those ones that has the capacitor in it. Because I believe that's the type of sparks you'll get from one of those. Also, I'm actually getting quite long sparks there. Get the sparks over an inch long. However, I can do plasma with one of these. Uh, okay, we had the microphone going into the thing there. Let's just turn it off. Yes, I'm trying to do a singing arc with this, and the microphone's output, I forgot, was plugged into this, so we had some audio feedback for, through the flyback. Get a good plasma arc though, as you can see. Nice long arcs. And I can do the singing arc through this. Better not play too much of that because Warner Music Group or whatever that is might nab me for it. Also, this thing over here is an early plasma speaker I'm trying to work on. I'm just going to connect the fly back up to that and try to do that. So we're going to turn the power off first. Discharge it. Make sure there's no charge on the flyback because I don't want to be zapped by this thing. I'm just trying to do this all in one shot, completely unedited and things like that. Okay. There's no charge left in this now, so I'm gonna wind, wind this wire around there. To my plasma speaker, which is top of a plastic bottle glued onto a piece of wood with some screws in it. Lost my train of thought then. Anyway, I'll just connect the high voltage wire to the other wire on the thing. Make sure that is neutral. Okay. Sorry if I'm standing in front of the camera at the moment. This is just going to be a direct unedited video so all the mistakes I make when I speak will be in this video but doesn't really matter okay I'm gonna turn the juice on can't really see it on the camera very good but there is an arc between the two screws now I'm gonna play some music through it
just need to make a few adjustments and the music's fading out while I'm trying to do this of course you can just stop it flapping around I'm sorry, I don't swing that way. So anyway, that's a little bit of an update there. Time to go and do some stuff. 